Geometry Dash with a Wii Remote. That's right, everyone. I have hooked up Geometry Dash to a Wii Remote. Technology has come so far, I know. I couldn't get motion controls to work, so how it works is I can use the nunchuck to uh, move the mouse around, and then I can use the Wii Remote to do all the other stuff. I have made a texture pack, so you can see all the correct buttons. It does use the nunchuck. So uh, let's just try out a level with this. So how it works is you point at the screen and you press A to jump. Works like an Xbox controller, except that it's a Wii remote, so it's a million times better. This is actually the smartest idea I've ever had. I honestly do not know why I didn't think of this sooner. It's it's Geometry Dash with a, with a Wii remote. I'm using a freaking Wii remote, look at this! The future is now! Watch, I'm even gonna get the coin. Oh my god, this is actually the best thing to happen to the world since, since ever. I cannot get over the fact that I'm playing with a Wii remote. This is, it's, it's brilliant. I love it. Ah. How did I die there? So I asked you guys on Twitter for some levels and stuff to check out with the Wii remote. So let's have a look at that. Alright, so first thing I'm going to try out is the lightning road. It shouldn't be too hard, but let's have a look. I don't understand why this level just gives you free coins. It's dumb. They're not verified though, so it doesn't really matter. Honestly, it's been forever since I played this level, so I don't know how long I'm going to last. Oh my god. Well, there's your answer. You know, I've always felt like I could touch one of those random portal scribble things and it'll trigger a secret way and let me skip the whole level, but... I'm pretty sure that's not true, or else it wouldn't be in a map pack. Mind you, people have been updating all the map pack levels to make easier versions, like Dynamic Untracked, for example, so I wouldn't be surprised if the whole thing just falls apart. Alright, let's move on, because map packs are garbage. So, the next suggestion is for me to play Apostrophe, my own level, so why not? Uh, fun fact actually, most of this level was made on car or bus rides. I make a lot of levels when I'm bored. It's been a long time since I played this. I do not think it'll last long because you have to mash at a lot of parts in this level and with a Wii remote that's not easy. Let's go for the coin. Ah, I totally forgot. <laughs> Never mind. I, I clicked the- I, I pressed A. I didn't click, I pressed A. Here we go. I got this. Oh, I'm so not ready for the ball part. I'm gonna get destroyed there. How do you do this with a Wii remote? Ah! Oh my god! Oh, you have to mash the A button. There's like latency and everything. Oh! The Wii Remote is garbage! No wonder the Wii didn't do so well. So, what's this week's weekly demon? Uh, alright, I'll skip this. Aquamarine by Lemons. Let's check it out with a Wii Remote. I'm so used to clicking low detail mode as a mobile player. Even still, it still lags. Off to a fantastic start. If I can beat the weekly with a Wii remote, I will be the maddest lad alive. Lemons, you deserve to send me a medal. Chances are I won't be able to beat the weekly in one or two attempts, so let's hop into practice mode. Uh, so how practice works here is you use the nunchuck to place and the B button to delete. So it would be Z or Z on the nunchuck to place, the big button on the back, and you delete with B. Why did I waste my time setting this up though? Ship part's fairly straightforward. Oh god. Oh my god, timing the robot is impossible on a Wii remote. I just can't. What's good about playing with a Wii Remote is that I could blame all my mistakes I make on the Wii Remote. Wiimote, Wii Remote, no one calls it a Wiimote. Well, 
Since I'm lazy and don't feel like beating the weekly demon, let's move on to the next suggestion. You know what? Why not? Let's do some wave challenges. Wait. Wait, how am I gonna type? Fine, I'll cheat. Let's do this one by Norris Stake, just because I like the song bonus level. If it's Envy, I like it. That's how it works. I swear I've seen this challenge before. I, I swear I've seen it, but whatever. It ain't that bad. I don't need the nunchuck for this. Boom! Wave challenge with a Wii remote. Done. What other first ever world records should we set? Let's do another one. You suck. Okay, fine. Good. Hacksaw. Rub rub. That was easy. I got a Wii remote! You know your wave challenge is easy if you beat it with a Wii remote. One more. Just one more. I actually think I made the home button pause. Yeah, I did. Just because why not? Oops. I'm just... I swear it's the Wii Remote. I swear it's not being bad. It's the Wii Remote! It's not me being bad at the game, I swear... It's all the Wii Remote's fault. It is all the Wii Remote's fault. It's the Wii Remote! I swear it's the Wii Remote! <laughs> Let's try another demon, but ramp up the difficulty a little bit. Decode. This was my tenth demon to ever beat, and it's probably one of my favorites. Let me move the mouse out of the way. You're welcome. I know you'd never see your teacher doing that. <laughs> I swear that if I had a Guitar Hero controller, I'd, I'd make a video on that, but I don't. Someone wants to buy me one. <laughs> No, no, don't. Don't. Please don't. Let's just skip right to the wave part. That's the spicy part. Here we go. Looks like this friend's done it for us. I don't get why people make such a big fuss out of this wave. It's really not that hard. But on a Wii remote? That's a bit of a different story. You know, who needs the mouse when you have this bad boy? Boom. Done on a Wii remote. Nailed it. Big surprise, someone suggested Bloodlust, but since I'm bad at the game and can't even get like a second into Bloodlust, let's do Bloodbath instead. At least make it past the shit part. I can definitely do this. I think I can. <sighs> I'm gonna be honest, Bloodbath is better than Bloodlust. There, I said it. Ah, I don't know how to do that part. The big demons like Bloodlust and God Eater and Killbot and whatever, they're all a lot harder than they should be just because of all the confusing decorations. Levels are meant to be straightforward and shouldn't be confusing as heck. There, I said it. Gotcha! Ah. Well, that's my new record. Tenge suggests that we play some recent levels. Let's have a look. Game by player. Don't hate the player, hate the game. I gotta say, that is the most fitting time to use that. Easy, as all recent levels are. Let's try Demon Slayer 9999's preview level. His third one. Ooh. Fancy. Okay, forget what I said. That's just stupid. I'm determined to get through that straight fly now. Watch this. Aha! Gotcha! Why do I keep saying gotcha? I swear that's not a habit of mine. One more recent level. Impossible Troll by Fire JB. Oh, you pecking son of. Uh, there's gonna be a secret somewhere. It has the name Troll. Where is it? Alright, something's definitely up here. Where's the low detail button? ID is 49307924. Feel free to try to figure out what's up with this level. I was looking on trending and I found a new Dansman level named Gay. 
we live in a society. This is the most Dan's Mini level I've ever seen. This, this perfectly fits Dan's Min style. <laughs> cool level. Looking forward to seeing it be the weekly demon. Let's try another level on trending. Alright, we're doing this one because it's named Wahoo. Like, how could you not play this? Ooh, we got a good one. Chop chop, moderators. This actually looks really nice. Gotta say, a lot of creators these days are really talented. I like these kinds of levels just because the style is a lot more simplistic. I don't like the... What do people call it? Core levels? They look really cluttered and chaotic. Never been a big fan of them. These ones are just a lot more chill. Especially when you play with a Wii remote. Did I really just do that? <sighs> I'm an idiot. This wouldn't be a good GD video without a jitter click challenge, so let's go for it. Okay, I'll, I pass. Alright, well, let's do this one instead. No way, I did not expect to get that on my first try. Ah! Ah! Gotcha! Done with a Wii remote. Nailed it. So the next and probably last level we're going to try is Master Game. And I think that's a really good suggestion. Uh, for this one, it's actually better to hold the Wii remote sideways because it fits two player levels. I think A is one of the buttons and the number is the other one. So I'm just going to skip. Oops. I'm just going to skip the intro. I think that's the password to skip. Don't remember. It's been a long time since I played. Reason it says I have 99% is because I originally beat it on stream, but then I lost my data. Oh god, this is going to be a lot of fun. So, Serpunge actually requested that I make it so that you shake the Wii remote to change direction, but again, I couldn't get motion controls to work. But if I do, I'm definitely making another video on this. I'm doing shake to jump. That's what I'm doing. Oh, it's such a good level. Everything's just done so well in it. Alright, we saved Pengo. Questioning how far I should get in this. Maybe I'll just... Uh-oh. Oh no. I'm gonna cut through there. Oh, I can actually... I forgot I can change direction with one. Forgot I set that up. I uh, used the sneaky little shortcut to sh skip forward to the snow area just because I can. So I'm going to skip right to the boss, just because that's technically where I left off before I lost my data, so might as well rebeat it. Now, I don't remember, were there like extra heart containers you could get? I think there were actually. Whatever, we're doing this on three. Alright, comment below, is this the best idea ever or the worst idea ever? Because I think that... Geometry Dash with a Wii remote is... It's just meant to be. How about we get a Switch port for Geometry Dash? A Switch port for Geometry Dash would be godlike. Uh, nothing's popping up. Nothing's popping up, help. I can't kill him. I think I broke the level. I think the Wii remote just... I think the Wii remote broke the level, guys. Serp, if you're watching this, fix your stuff. Unless I forget how to play this game, that's correct. No, this definitely looks broken. Well, it ain't about the destination, it's about the journey. And that journey was done with a Wii remote, and that's what really matters. Geometry Dash with a Wii remote. Subscribe and I'll ship you your own personalized GD colon Wii remotes to try this out for yourself.